program which connects you to the rest of the world. EU, Morocco, Egypt, Tunisia, Algeria, Libya, International Cooperation 2 or EU Metallic 2. EU-funded project which aims to bridge the gap between EU and MENA institutions by bringing people together. The EU Metallic 2 program provided scholarships to 220 scholars at undergraduate, master, doctorate, postdoctorate and staff levels for a period up to 36 months over the past four years. Let's hear from our EU Metallic 2 scholars and partners. For me, one of the most memorable experiences was mainly meeting so many people that come from so many different cultures and also the fact that you become your own parent. You have to deal with a lot of factors that you didn't have to deal with before, whether it's um, shopping, cleaning your room, studying, you have to organize everything and you really grow as a person and discover yourself a lot. I think it's a very valuable experience. Some of my most memorable experiences were being part of the partner team. They gave me my own workspace which meant a lot to me because I felt valued and I had somewhere to, to sit every day when I went into work. They made me feel really, really welcome, which was very important to me. They hosted me so generously that it, it just made the whole experience fantastic. I made Italian and international friends and this helped me to discover the European culture and in particular uh, the Italian way of life. I think we all had um, the luck to be in a place where everyone was so acceptant of different cultures and because everyone is sort of in the same context we all were very open to each other we exchanged things that we know from our culture but at the same time we, we, know, we knew that we were here for each other and there was no racism, no fear of someone who's coming from another place. It was a, we were all together like a family and I think that's really important. I came to Rome in 2014 speaking little Italian and after taking Italian classes at La Sapienza I am able to communicate almost in a fluent way in what I consider now my fourth language. My visit was uh, successful actually in different and many levels. Uh, this visit gave me a good experience in a new area of expertise, uh, phytochemistry, which I will use for myself and for my students when I return to my home university. This uh, mobility visit actually also gave me a chance to contact people and exchange ideas and thoughts and make friendships with them. Being a La Sapienza student has helped me achieve a substantial improvement and maturation of my research method. I also had the chance to attend a number of conferences in Rome outside the university, like in the, in the Center for American Studies and the American Academy in Rome. I was able to present a paper in an international conference entitled The Experience of War in History, Folklore and Literature. I would recommend that this kind of exchange mobility visits and scholarships be strengthened and continued. I recommend it categorically, yes. Working in the framework of Erasmus Mundus programs of EU Metallic 2 has allowed the University of Graz to become more familiar with the educational frameworks of partner countries, as well as to become more familiar with the administrative and academic procedures directly linked to the exchange of staff and uh, postdocs and students. I'd say that um, programs such as these are a 
success story for the, all the universities involved um, and definitely benefit not only the grantees but also the institution as a whole. First of all, I have to say that Erasmus Mendes program met an enormous success since its launch in the Mediterranean and in my country in particular. The project put objectives corresponding to the mutual enrichment of the countries of the Europe and others, not only in the academic field, but also in educational, cultural and economical ones. We would like to thank our joint coordinator CIST for their support throughout the project, as well as all partners and associate partners for their cooperation. And finally, we wish all of the scholars the best of luck in their future careers.